Well, I was asked to come and uh, look at this donkey right here. And then somebody wasn't doing his job properly. Right now I trimmed this one. But this is what I have. And what I see is that it had an old abscess and it just stayed in there and it kept on getting abscesses. Now this one, we have one that popped up right here, right there. And the hoof, that hoof was like this and probably even longer. I just trimmed it. And this is what I got. An abscess right here. And it started to drain up there, so that's why I'm getting no blood right here. But I'm gonna, I trimmed it, so I'm gonna trim it a little bit more and see what's going on. So here, all I'm doing is, uh, you know, digging it out and make sure it's clean. And now last time I posted a video, somebody said, oh, stop digging. I mean, have you ever worked on an abscess? Have you ever figured out how, what's wrong, or what's going on, and how much damage you got inside? So you have to find what your problems are, make sure you get them all out. Somebody says, unless Pablo has an MS medical certificate, since when a shoer needs a medical certificate to work in an abscess? Stop digging. I have to dig. I have to find out. I have to get all the uh, bad stuff out. Then I cure it, put medicine on it, and then uh, pack it and close it. Now, even though I have to work more on it, that's kind of like uh, how a hill feet supposed to look like, not like that. We'll fix that one in a minute after I fix that uh, abscess. Wow. Now, what I did, I poke around in it a little bit, and this was going to help it drain some, and it's going to help it take the swellness off and it's gonna relieve the pain that it has. So, um, bear with me. Okay, so I'm gonna let that one drain for a little bit. And then I'm gonna work on this one and see what happens. Okay, now I picked this one up and this is what we have here. And it looks like it already has a hole in it from uh, probably an older abscess. So, uh, this is what I gotta deal with. I'm gonna clean it up and see what's going on. It's done? Okay, so now I gotta take all this soil out right here. Find out where the bottom soil is. There's no soil. And I took a lot of frog off and still got a lot more going on. So now here, I start a little bit high. Oh, oh, oh. I'm jumping because of the pain on the other side. Not because of what's going on here. So I'll just try to do a quick cleanup. And... This is what we have here. So this is the old abscess right here. This is just foundering, lameness, and everything at once. So I gotta find out what's going on here. I try to make small, smallest hole as I can. Okay, so I don't have nothing. So I'm gonna let, let, let it rest a little bit. But now I'm gonna fix that.
See right here, this is where the old abscess was at. This is where the old abscess was at right here. That's where that one came out. All right, we're gonna work in the bottom. And we're just gonna fix the bottom. Okay, so I'm just gonna dig in a little bit here, see what we have. I know it came out from the top. Try to come out from the bottom. That's gonna relieve some pressure. I know it still has it in there. So there it is. I just want it to bleed. So now that we have them, I'm gonna let them drain. We're gonna medicate the other one. And take it from there like you saw that before and now you see the after <laughs> 